Welcome to Draw with Skip. Our friends Abigail and Mackenzie suggested that we draw an elephant. Elephants are cool. I think so. Drawing lightly with our pencil, let's draw an oval like this. Then a smaller circle here, like this. That's our head and our body. Now, starting at the top of that circle, we're going to make a line that goes down, around, and out. That's where the trunk will go. Another line from the bottom, right about here, and back up towards the head. We'll work on those details later. Let's move on to the eye. It will go right about here. Next, the ear. Now, if I'm going too fast, you can always press pause. A line like this, around to there, and then another line back towards the head, and one more like this. Great. Now for the front leg. Starting at the bottom of the circle, we're going to bring a line down, across, and back up towards the body. For the rear leg. We'll start right about here, down, across, back up towards the oval, and around like that. Let's mark in the ground. There we go. Now it looks like he's standing on the ground. How about those legs on the other side? And over here. Now an elephant has a tail, so I'm going to follow the contour of the elephant's body, like this, going down, and then from the end of that line back in towards the body, like this. Now at the end of that tail, there's some hairs, sort of like a paintbrush. Now it's time to take out our black marker, or your black crayon. And let's ink our elephant. Okay, like this. Now, elephant experts say that an elephant has fingers at the end of their trunk, so let's draw them in like this, and then back up towards the head. Great. Now let's put the details of the mouth. A line like this, and then a line like. Great. The eye, I like to leave a little white. Okay, now the ear. Okay. From the bottom of the mouth, this line here, and now that front leg. Okay. We'll follow that oval line, at the bottom of the body there, and that leg that's behind. Okay. The rear leg, back up, around to the tail. Let's not forget that leg behind. There we go. Okay. I'm going to follow the contour of the body again. Right down to the tail. Great. Back up towards the body, and those hairs at the end. Let's not forget the ground. Now it's time for some details. Did you know elephants have toenails? They do. So let's draw those in like this. Some trunk lines. I think these lines really make it look like a trunk. Some hairs. They do. Elephants have little hairs. Some wrinkle lines. Great. Let's erase away our pencil lines. 
wipe away our eraser dust, and there's our elephant. Great job! Now it's your turn to color. Thanks for drawing with me. Be sure to subscribe to this channel if you like these draw-alongs. You can also share with your friends. See you next time.